Jellyfish, if you watch this, I love you, girl. Just thought I'd say that. <laughs> What's up, everybody? It's your girl, T-Dog, and today I'm going to tell you a little story about how I met my, my best, best friend, Jellyfish. Now, you guys can see in the background, I did string Christmas lights. It is not close to Christmas just yet, where I'm at. No, I got bored last night, and I decided to string Christmas lights along my bed. So these right here flicker, and these right here don't. So those in the background might flicker, but anyway... Um, how I met my friend Jellyfish was in 6th grade. I'm in 7th grade now, but in 6th grade, which was last year. Uh, last year I was a new kid. And I didn't know what to do. And I was in a new school. I didn't, I didn't know what to do. I didn't know anybody. So, there was this one girl. And she somehow knew me, but I didn't know her. She somehow knew me, but I didn't know her. So, I was in gym class one day, and I was lonely because I didn't have anybody to, like, talk to or anything because I didn't know anybody and I didn't make any friends. Well, I was just sitting in gym class playing on my computer because we got a little free time. And I actually, like, there was this girl that came up to me, and she's like, hey, how are you? I said, I'm good. How are you? She said, that's good. Um, so you were over here lonely, and I didn't know, like, maybe you needed to talk to somebody or something. I said, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I'm just new here and I don't know what to do. And it was actually my best friend now, to this day still, it was actually Jessica. She is the one that came up to me and asked me if I would be her friend. So, we became friends and then we had all classes throughout the day together. But see, our PE class last year was... Sixth hour, because we had seven classes, Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. On Wednesdays, we had eight classes. So, anyway, we had the last class together. And I had this one kid that sat at my table, and he's my ex-boyfriend now, but I had this one kid, and he sat at my table, and he said something, he called my friend weird. I said, call my friend weird one more time, and I will break all your fingers. Why I said that, I'll never know, but for some reason, I instantly first start, started protecting her. And if all y'all know me, I'm a protective, I am very, very protective over my friends. Why, I will never know. It's just a thing that's in my instincts to protect my friends. But I just don't know why, but I'm very protective over my friends and I've never, like, done that before. But, um, I've never, like, I've never been so protective of my friends as I am now. I am very protective over Jessica. But, um, anyway, back to the story. So, the next, we started hanging out a couple days. And we kept hanging out and kept hanging out and kept hanging out. And then, finally, I told her, I said, hey, are we friends? And she's like, yeah, of course we're friends. I said, oh, well, I thought I'd ask because I, I didn't know because you, like, kept hanging out with me. And I didn't know if you liked me or not. She's like, oh, yeah, of course, I like you. You're awesome. And she told, I think she told me, because, like, this happened last year, and my memory is, like, very bad. She's like, of course I like you. You're, like, a good friend to me. I'm like, thank you. And I've never had, I know the story was kind of short, but I've never had a friend just like Jessica. To this day, we are still friends. We still fight. We're friends. Friends have, that ups, have their ups and downs, but, hey. It's a whole part of life, and it's a whole part of friendship. Me and her are hoping that we'll be friends till we die. So, I am really happy about that. I hope that we are friends till we die, because she is one of my best friends. So, sorry, she's texting me right now. But, um, I really hope that you guys enjoy this video. I didn't know when to do it or how to do it, so I thought I would do it in my new setup. Sorta. Of. I need to kind of get my setup going a little bit, but um, these lights are really starting to drive me insane. But I really don't know how to do this or say this because I know you're probably gonna watch this, Jessica. And Jessica, if you watch this, I really do loaf you. That is our version of love. But I loaf you slash love you, and I will be your friend forever. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this video. It was sort of a short video, 
sort of like probably about five minutes long. Probably, I don't know. But I had nothing better to do. I was bored. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below what you guys think I should do next. And I will make sure to subscribe because I forgot to say that in my last video, but I put it in in my new outro. In my new outro. So, yay. So, um, anyway, make sure to subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. I love you. Mwah.